The reset of the roll position to zero should be done each time the operator starts to work with the machine. To reset each axis, manually move the axis to its lowest position and simply press the reset button, which corresponds to the axis you wish to reset. From the manual screen, it's possible to see the position of the rotation along with the left and right side roll movements designated Z, Y, and X. Creation of a new program is done by rolling apart and recording each step in the control to be repeated by the computer. Exit manual mode by pressing the exit button. Register as user 1 by touching the username box and entering the number 1. Touch the password box and enter the password. You can see when you have successfully logged in by the appearance of the logout button. The edit button takes you to the program screen. To create a new program, press the new button. If there is already a program loaded, you are prompted to press the new button a second time to confirm. Now give your new program a name by touching the name box and entering it using the on-screen keyboard. Pressing the green enter button takes us to the input screen. On this screen in the upper left, we can see the value of the axis X, Y, and Z as we position the rolls to manufacture the part. When the roll is in the position desired, you simply press the letter that corresponds to the movement. On the right side of the screen, you can see the step that you have just created. Press the enter button to confirm. Once confirmed, you will see the step is moved to the body of the program. Enter each step you make as you continue to roll your part until you have built a complete program. The final step of every program must contain the end command. After the program is written, you must save the program. Press the exit button to leave the programming page and enter the store by touching the store button. Press the plus or minus button until you arrive at the number where you wish to save the program or touch the program number and enter the desired number using the on-screen keyboard. Press the Save button to assign the program to the number selected. Reload the program to the active memory by pressing the Load button. To run the program, exit the store by pressing the Exit button. Switch the manual automatic selector to Automatic and touch the Run button to enter the Execute screen. Press the Start button and then hold the dual palm buttons on each side of the control pedestal to execute the program. To edit programs, return to the Edit Programs page and enter the program to be modified. Using the up or down buttons, select the step to be modified. Touch the letter of the access, then touch the current value on the screen. Type in the new value using the on-screen keyboard and then press enter. To delete a step in the program, use the up or down buttons to locate the step to be deleted and press the delete button. To insert a step, locate the step number prior to the location of the new step. Press Insert. An open space is created after the selected step. Input the new step information, pressing Enter to confirm. After the changes have been made to the program, return to the store and save the program, either overriding the existing program or saving it in a new empty position. Contact MG.